Hello everyone, welcome to Skull Salon. In this video, uh, in this series, we are going to create a series to creating uh, how to create uh, this animation video by uh, Yum Yum Videos. So we are going to try in this series how to create each and every frame and also you will get to know uh, how much time it will take to create uh, these kind of animations so we'll do one thing we are we will go uh, slide by slide so uh, in this video we are going to start from the first slide as well so just I'll do one thing I'm going to create a slide one okay that's it I'm importing this video here and also I have already uh, you know uh, save a character for uh, uh, for this so I'm just uh, importing that character so this is my man I have I'm going to import it by you no know, selecting composite uh, composition written layer size so i'm importing this file as well also i'm going to tell you that uh, i didn't do any preparation for this video so i just want to show you that how much time it will take to create these kind of animations so that's why i didn't take any preparation uh, i just uh, did one thing i uh, i have just did one thing i have you know created i have uh, separated these characters each and every you know uh, each and every body parts for the animation that's it i have done it so i just cut these frames and copy all of these frames here okay this is it I have imported this thing. I just want to, you know, uh, uh, I just want to open this. Oh, sorry, this one for the center of this thing. So I'm just doing one thing. I'm just placing my character into the center. Okay. Along with that, I have to, you know create a screen here so i am creating it yeah this will be the this will be my screen and i am just placing this screen at the bottom as of now i am hiding this layer so at this point just we will first create this thing so for that i am just seeing yeah these are going you know first uh, this shape is uh, fading in then these icons are coming so i am going to do the same also uh, i will just open my illustrator first uh, because i need uh, these graphics as, uh, as well so at that time i will just open uh, my shape here and also I need to change the color of it so I'm going to you know give a color something like this yeah also I have to create a shape here so I'm again uh, taking a shape layer just creating a shape yeah and also control and double click here for you know uh, placing the anchor point at the center of this shape so that's it also i have to change the color so i am going to give a little bit darker color or i can give it a white color instead of it but also i just uh, want i am planning to you know give the uh, 
background color white so yeah that is actually i am thinking right now but this color is merging with the background color so i am going to do one thing i am going to change the color of this thing to uh, yellow i guess this will work for me yeah this will work i guess so also uh, my illustrator is open now so i have to search for pv icons let's see no we didn't get it actually i'm just search sound icon yeah i got the sound icon i am just uh, copy this image and very illustrator yeah uh, creating a new file opening a new artboard yeah my artboard is open i'm just pasting that image here yeah. also there is an option image trace i'm just clicking it Okay. the image is uh, traced now i'm going to expand right click on the object and going to ungroup and select this thing and delete and just scale i have to scale this thing yeah it's good also uh, what we have in the video let's as of now just hide these things second is setting i need a setting icon mm. we are going to take this one so i'll do same for this just copy this image and pasting this image into illustrator oh this is black screen is going so that's why i have to use another image so just uh copy this image and this one is also going black so for copy this image oh this image is also going black what is going on copy image and paste yeah so again i am going to trace this image now going to oh sorry expand first and ungroup and delete these unnecessary icons this has to be the same size that we need yeah that is okay for me third one is uh, something like this so it will take time to you know uh, search for this thing so we are going to draw this so i'm just uh, doing i have a uh, overload next uh, extension here in after effect so i'm just select this setting option and i'm going to select the overload and deleting this also selecting this sound icon and just click on the overload so i have all the icons available in two layers so i'm just going to do one thing um, going to place all of both of the icons here yeah firstly i'll open my shots here so that's why it will be easy for me to you know adjust these icons so this is my first icon here ah this is my second icon here okay uh, i need to change the color so i'm just picking that this color here okay and also i need one more icon so i have to you know uh, create that icon so for that i am also again going to take a shape here yeah. So I am placing this shape first. 
now I need a I need to draw a shape so I am going to I have just drawn a shape but I don't need uh, the fill so I have to uh, close the fill and okay open strokes so I'm going to get it one and also I have to change the color yeah that's it okay now I have to do one thing I have to just select this thing and go to the transform of shape 2 and just have to send to the anchor point here again I am going to rotate no. The anchor point is not in the center so I will just uh, select the shape 2 and by con pressing control just double click on it but there is a problem my anchor point is not moving so manually I have to you know adjust it now I can rotate it so with that I am going to rotate it like minus 270 I am going to rotate it and adjusting this thing again I have to duplicate this shape layer and uh, selecting this shape Yeah, again I have to rotate this by minus 180. Okay, it's cool. One more time we have to duplicate this thing and also select this shape layer to moving it something like here and also I am going to rotating it again to minus 90 so here we are we have got our third icon here so I am just do one thing yeah just double click it by placing the anchor points at the center and that's it So this is our shot now also just hide these things to see what is yeah we need a stars here so I'll do one thing at this position I also need these stars so I'm going to you know again uh, taking a shape layer at this time I'm going to change the color so that uh, we didn't have that much difficulty to create you know to identify things so this is the uh, shape this is the poly star I have created and I'm going to the poly star path and here I'm going it it's 5 already here yeah so it's it's not difficult so we'll do one thing we just uh, yeah go at this position and i am going to uh, trace this shape this point this point i am creating this shape with the help of the pad tool here yeah our shape is done here so again i am going to open all of my layers 
and uh, I just want to you know yeah give the white color to the stars also I just want to give a yellow shades yellow auto shades so for that I just want to select my yeah select my this thing copy uh, where is our star this is our star and just paste this stroke color okay that's it also i again i am just uh, unhiding all the other layers and we'll do one thing one two three four so we are going to copy this thing four times one two three four guys you are watching that the anchor point is not at the center so for that i am just again controlling uh, selecting all these layers and by pressing ctrl double click on this point so that our all the stars will be at the center so this is it our uh, our shot is completed that's that's all what we have in this shot okay so now i'm going to you know animate these things as well so as of now we just forget all of these things and i just want to rename and what is this oh. this is Shoulder we can shoulder we can name it shoulder. This is yes elbow. I'm going to name it elbow. And this is S shoulder. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry guys um, my, my shoulder spelling is not correct so sorry for that I'm going to name it here this is air one this is we are going to name it air two okay this is the neck this is the body this is the face this is the torso I am going to name it torso and this is the elbow yeah there is s hand is missing so i am going to duplicate this thing okay and also i am going to transform and flip vertical this so this will look like this will look like this also i am going to rotate this thing here also merging this thing with the hand okay so at that time i'm going to do one thing i'm going to uh, just open this thing first so i'm going to move body to the top also torso should be under the body Okay, and uh, S elbow, elbow should be here with uh, hand to, no, elbow should be, uh, should be here with hand, hand to should be here with 
as well. So these are different. So I'm going to uh, give a different color to these persons, these objects, and shoulder. Uh, shoulder should be at the top. Here also shoulder should be at the top. Okay. Here, here, neck. Where is neck? Uh, neck i am just placing the neck here and face ears here is over the neck so now it's a parenting time so i have to you know uh, parent face ear here with the sorry and here with neck yeah neck should be with the body and we don't need to uh, parent torso so also uh -huh, elbow uh, hand hand should be parented and just this is downwards so it will be easy and should be with elbow and elbow will be with shoulder same for here as well hand should be in elbow and elbow should be parent with the shoulder and both of the shoulders have to parent with the body where is body there you go So now it's done. Also, I have to uh, place this hand. This hand is not at its correct position. So I'm going to uh, I'm going to the elbow. Just do one thing. Just adjust the anchor point first. Now I'm going to the rotation and. this is it for me as well also i'm going to rotate a shoulder a little bit so also i have to adjust these shoulders here also i just increasing the property of shoulder Okay. I don't need sound at this time. So anchor point should be at this position. And also there is a cutted thing is going on here. So I'm just parented all the things here. Okay. Also the hand is you know little weird to me, so I have to also we have to adjust the anchor point of hand so yeah now it's looking good for me so the shot is completely ready just uh, one thing we should have to need uh, this scale so i'll search for a scale so I have searching on uh, free pick for the uh, the measuring thing what we needed. So let's see. Uh, did we get anything? Uh -huh.
you can say this actually I don't know the actual name of this so just fitness time bottle concept no it's not the correct name it's the vector lose weight What is the name of it actually? Three vector construction. I'm not getting the proper name of it. Yeah, it's a measuring tape. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we are not uh, we are not going to search too much too much. So I'm going to so I'm going to download this graphic. Yeah, it's downloaded. I am going to extract this file here. So now just open this file in the after effect. This is we don't need this anymore. It's a very complicated graphic. So just have to This is the scale what we have got. This is the scale. I'm just going to scale it down. So I am also saving this file. Uh, Measuring tape. Okay, this one we got. We also need to, you know, uh, we also need to have uh, this kind of baby. So let's see if we'll get anything or we have to. Uh, if there is nothing we got, then we have to, you know, uh, draw it itself. So let's search for it actually. It will search for measuring. Maybe we we'll get something when someone is measuring. No, there is no so uh, we just have to you know uh, draw it itself. So, just one thing I'm just going to import the measuring tape here. Also, just placing this tape.
it's not uh, looking good i guess so i have to you know stretch this scale here so firstly i'm doing i'm just uh, correcting its position here for this i'm just taking an angle point yeah it's good i guess so yeah we have got this tape just place it above a little bit so that just do one thing i'm just placing this at the top so that i can adjust all the things here first so at scale i am going to scale this thing here so at this point just to rotate this a little bit so i have to scale it down a little bit uh this one so i have to adjust the rotation as well just a slight down on the scales so a little bit more i have to scale light down yeah it's good for me also i just have to place this scale down also i need this kind of uh, this kind of thing so i'm going to we definitely have to get something which we can which we can use in our animation so we are not getting that uh, kind of so we are not getting that kind of graphics here so i am going to do one thing i'm just uh, just do one thing i'm just uh, changing the color blue is uh, blue so i'm going to change it by orange also i'm going to duplicate this graphic add also just doing one thing just creating a mask okay now just placing this mask here and i just have to scale it down a little bit yeah it's something like this also have to center the anchor point and rotating this thing a little bit here also just select the mask and open it a little bit here okay also i am going to take a puppet tool here and two points i have just placed here and at this point and this points i have taken here so i am going to give it something yeah we have to we have did something 
like this animation and also just where is the mask actually i'm not able to see okay so mask i have to take this to the Also, I have to place this anchor point here. Yeah, that's it. Also, I'll do the same thing for the another side, just duplicating this and going to transform and click vertical, then just placing this thing here and also have to rotate it downwards yeah so my shot is totally completed here so at this time i just do one thing i am going to uh, hide these tapes I'll do one thing. I'll just I'll just do the uh, now my uh, complete shot is done. So in next video we will uh, you know create the animation. So that is all for this video. Thank you for watching.